Deanna asks, is it acceptable to God for us to be cremated? Well, that's a good question. I'll have to ask him when I see him. But I want to give you two, like, guesses. One is a scientific thought. The other is a biblical thought. Here's the scientific thought. The reason, historically, that some Christians have objected to cremation is that if you burn the body, how will Jesus resurrect your body? But is it really more difficult for Jesus to resurrect the atomic particles that have been split by fire than to re-engage the atomic particle, particles that have been disintegrated, go into the ground, into microbes, become, a, become grass, and cows eat the grass, and the cow runs off? Is it more difficult for God to resurrect a disintegrated body in the ground or a burned body? I, I, he's God. He can, he can do either one just as easily. And in fact, this is my second thought. It says in 2 Peter chapter 3 that the earth and its works will be burned up. And specifically in chapter 12 and 13 of 2 Peter 3, it says that there will then be from the old earth a new heaven and a new earth. If you take that literally, then the particles burned in the old earth will be created or recreated into a new heaven and a new earth. So at least we have a model. Long, long, long answer made really short. I think it's okay. If you found this video helpful, uh, could you do me a favor? Just hit the like button, or, or even better, share it with a friend.